So this is a theory about the mystery spring lock suit from Sister Location. You know the one that might get trapped inside on Nightfire the game? I have a theory about who I think it could be. I want to get this out there before the release of Help Wanted 2. Since the game is covering the Sister Location and Pizzeria Simulator era of FNAF, and we might actually get an answer on this soon. Honestly, I think it'd be really funny if I was just completely wrong about this, which is why I want to get this out there. So, just a warning before I begin, please don't take this theory super seriously. The answer I give is only because we haven't gotten any evidence about what character this suit could be. Except for one. There's one character that has had a few weird ties to the Funtime animatronics that I've seen get overlooked, and this character... Let's just say this character isn't taken super seriously and doesn't seem very lore relevant. So if it ends up filling the role of a huge seven year long mystery in this franchise, people might get kind of mad. Hypothetically, if I'm right about this, this probably wasn't something planned from the start and Scott and Steel Wool either did this to be a bit cheeky, a bit funny, play a little haha on us, the community, or it's for some other crazy lore stuff. Either way, I'm just here to point out this observation. I could be totally wrong about this. So let me take you on the journey I had that led to this horrible theory. I was reading Fazbear Fright's book 10, released just a few months before Security Reach. I was on the third story titled Together Forever. TLDR, it's about some girls in a robotics class assigned to fix up an old junkyard animatronic. This animatronic is a pig by the name of Rosie Porkchop. The girls discover that this animatronic is a spring lock suit. Not only that, it has some other abilities as well. Stuff like voice mimicking and the ability to trap children in her stomach. As I was reading this story, I immediately made the connection that this animatronic shared a lot of abilities with the fun times, who have stated in their blueprints that they can mimic voices and hold children captive. On top of that, Rosie was a spring lock suit, Circus Baby stated that the spring lock and sister location came from her old pizzeria, so it would be a funtime animatronic as well, and would probably have some of the same abilities. Rosie is also described as having a lot of ruffles, sort of similar to Baby and Ballora, though Rosie seems to be made of fabric covering a metal shell rather than just the hard plastic or metal that makes up the fun times. These were all just somewhat loose connections anyways, it wasn't enough to prove that the seven year mystery spring lock was a pig all along, to me at least. I never really thought too much of it, but it still lingered in the back of my mind. Fast forward to the release of Security Breach. I was watching my friend stream the game. I can't remember what area he was in and I'm too lazy to find it, but it was an area with arcade machines. I know this one arcade titled Funtime Fantasy. Decorated with fantasy variants of the Funtime animatronics, Pretty straightforward. And then I, I looked a little closer and I saw him. <laughs> Why is Big Patch on the Funtime Fantasy arcade machine? What is he doing there? What? What? And then I suddenly remembered Rosie Porkchop. I mean, I always assumed Rosie was just a variant of Pig Patch anyways. It wouldn't be the first time this franchise changed up genders across variants of certain characters. So when I saw that arcade machine, my mind was blown. I now have proof that a version of Pig Patch is classified as a fun time shown by concrete in-game evidence and a version of Pig Patch that is a spring lock with fun time animatronic abilities. I'm definitely not saying that the Pig Patch animatronic we see in Pizzeria Simulator is the same animatronic as the one in Sister Location. The faces don't even match up but it could very well be a variant of Pig Patch or Rosie that we have yet to see. Watch Help One and Two come out and reveal the mystery spring lock and I'm like totally wrong and it's actually a lore relevant character. Who knows, maybe Pig Patch is a lore relevant character. He does have the same eye colors as Tiger Rock, just mirrored, so you never know. I'm tired, I gotta go work on my finals now so that I can graduate college. I hope you enjoyed this theory, see ya.